what's going on guys illusions here today bringing you a brand new video and this is how to get your follower train and follower notification on twitch using uh open broadcaster software so what you're going to want to do um is open up chrome or whatever whatever browser you have here there it is and all right so we're going to start off <clears throat> with follower notification and so this is the one that i use um here so we're gonna go to nightdev.com. I'll have the link in the description. Nightdev.com. It's it's really not hard to do. So we're gonna want to click on projects, right? And they have a whole bunch of stuff. But what we want is follower alert, right? So this will alert. It'll look like this. That's the default one. It'll look like that whenever uh, someone follows your stream. It'll look like that. It'll come up. You can say like thanks for follow, whatever. You can have a sound. So I'm gonna teach you guys how to do that. Alright, so, um, watch this install video if you have not already, or, um, actually, never mind, don't even, don't even watch it, I'll, I'll show you, okay, um, login with Dropbox, what the heck, they changed it, what the heck, login with Dropbox, I don't have Dropbox, what the hell, well, I guess you need to get a Dropbox link, well, that's stupid, I'll be right back. I'll go. I'll go make a Dropbox. I'll be right back. All right. So I've made a Dropbox account and it let me it let me in here. Um. So. All right. So what you're gonna want to do now? You're gonna be on this screen after you make a Dropbox account and you have to like hit allow or whatever. It wasn't that hard. Um. You're gonna want to type in your Twitch channel. Illusions YT. It's mine. Alert style. There's a there's a whole bunch now. Um. You used to only have like two. But you have thin rectangle, which is right here. You have wide rectangle, which is right there. Trapezoid. Flip trapezoid, old flat, old stat, and use my own. All right, so what I did, I did use my own, and I did text centered so that the text was in the center, and I made my own. Many of you guys know if you watch my streams, I have the Welcome to the Illuminati, and I have like the Illuminati eyes or whatever. So uh, let's just go with the normal one and um alert transition so you can have it slide up slide down you can just have it pop up so we're gonna do like slide slide left so it's gonna come in from the left <coughs> or it's gonna come in from the right and slide left and you can choose a color whatever color you want we're gonna do red because that's the color like my theme and if you want a sound you can choose a sound but they have to be in the ogg format they have a, a converter here to convert it you can just click that to convert it so we're gonna go to next and it's gonna it's gonna generate the URL that you have to put into OBS, all right? So what you want to do is copy this, Control C, copy that, and then all right. So I'm gonna show you. Um, wait, where did that just go? Did that just disappear? I guess it just disappeared. Um, so what you're gonna want to do? You're gonna go into OBS. Here, I'll make it full screen. You're gonna go into OBS. Go to Add. You're gonna go to um, CLR browser and notice how it follower uh, alert, and then you're gonna hit OK, and the, the URL is going to be whatever it just was, and you're gonna hit OK, and then <clears throat> if you want to test it out, you go to the end of the URL, make sure it's working. I'm pretty sure I got it. Make sure it's working. You type the and sign, so you're gonna type and equals preview um oh no it's and preview equals true i think preview equals true then you hit okay and then it should pop up there it is and then you can move it wherever you want put it at the bottom put it right here put it right there whatever so that's how you get the follower alert now we're gonna move on to the follower train now um so let's go to the follower train for this, you're going to need to go to twitchalerts.com, or just Google Twitch Alerts, um, and I'll have the link in the description, and you go to launch Twitch Alerts, and you connect with Twitch, connect your account, you're going to have to log in, so this is my homepage, um, and what you're going to want to do, you're going to want to go to um, stream labels. All right, so you go to stream labels here on the left, and you download stream labels. Now I already have it, but what you're gonna want to do is once you get it, 
you open up the stream labels and you and it's gonna have like you can put most recent donor you can put like most recent sub if you have a sub button or you can, you can have a whole bunch of stuff and the follow train is new so um um here it is follow train clock follow train that is follower follow train counter text and you have to like all right so when you download this you have to put it into one of your files so go to computer i put it in my i have like a twitch alerts um there, i have a twitch alerts thing and <clears throat> it has all the things so you can see here follow train clock follow train counter follow train latest follower follow or so it has these three so it's gonna have the clock that counts down the counter and the latest follower and so what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna have that and you're gonna have your obs there's my obs there it is and you may you add a text um scene and i'm just gonna name it follow train uh counter so that's gonna be the one that counts um how many followers you have in your train so you can change the font change the font size whatever and what you want to do though is use text from file and then you have to find where you put it go to my twitch alerts thing and follow train counter and you click that and you do okay and so up here you can see there's a zero right so that's that's the counter right there there's the counter and then i'm going to add another one text uh follow train clock and then hit ok browse follow train clock and hit ok and there's the clock right there so then you have the clock and the counter um right next to each other and then <clears throat> add one more follow train uh most recent and use text from file browse follow train latest follower okay and then it'll have the latest follower here and once you get a follower you're gonna have to like adjust this box to however big like you need it but uh the follower will come like right up here i don't know if you guys, you guys can probably see this follower to come like oh well that doesn't make it any better okay, let me undo that. all right so the follower is going to come like right here and then it'll have the timer and then this number will go to one and you can change the font whatever let's change it to just Arial, like regular okay and they're the same um so there you go and there's your follow train so um yeah that's basically it um on my stream i'll change it here you can see i have um take out my webcam for now because i don't know because my green screen's not working or it's not working but it's not on um but as you can see the bottom right there there's my follow train in the red space that's where the most recent follower come up and then the clock and then i have the number and then i have the the counter so that's basically it guys uh, i hope you enjoy and i hope you have fun streaming and i hope this helps if it did leave a like if it didn't leave a like um and have fun streaming and good luck with your follow trains and follow notifications um see you guys later thanks for watching peace out